Atlanta. The crowd now waiting with big, big anticipation. One leg to go. Andant, who was some way back in fourth, fifth place, saved something to the last, but fumbled with a baton a bit to Brossier. So that allows Anna Polinari of Italy a clean run through. Agard looks to be hurting that. Hope he's okay. So Italy, France, Great Britain, Portugal have dropped back, and then the Polish. Round this final bend. Polinari still for Italy. Brossier and then Macaulay for Great Britain. But they've all got to watch for Natalia Kazmarek. Inside the Stadion Slaski, in front of a home crowd. Kazmarek surely round the outside all the way into lane three. Perhaps it was inevitable as Poland take victory in the final event in 3 12 17. But it's half a second slower than the Czech Republic. 3 12 3 for them. Absolutely extraordinary. Well, what do you make of that? Poland, of course, the class act as far as Nick's 4x400 meter relay running is being concerned since this event came onto the championship program. But they've been beaten out by the Czech Republic in the overall standings. France, their superb run from the quartet, the French quartet of Biron, Felter, Mondon, and Rossier to take a national record and themselves to move up into the top 10 all-time list of the European nations. Italy, well, it's the cherry on the cake for the Italians, finishing third in that race. And although all the cheers were for the Poles coming home and finishing with a victory, Poland getting their fifth victory of these three days of competition. It's that team, the Italians, wearing the Azzurri, who are going to be crowned very shortly the champions of Europe, Europe's top nation. Well, so, what, what a thrilling race from start to finish. As we say, these mixed four by fours just do not disappoint. Remember Division 2 with Slovenia and Lithuania battling it out. And uh, that coming down to half a point for the promotion battle into this, into Division 1. Right to uh, race in the top echelons of this sport. So, um, Ayomidi Foloronzo of Italy in the second leg. She had an absolutely brilliant run. I say Katia as a video of Portugal did as well, as did Ricardo dos Santos here in the third leg. By the time we got to the fourth leg, it was a strong run for Ala Polinari, but you could feel that the pressure was just building. This is the look back at uh, the third leg. Alessandro Sibilo, the 400 meter hurdler, having a very good leg for Italy. But there we go. That is the concluding stages here of the mix 4x4. And the stadium came to life. The noise was roaring Natalia Kasmarek down the down the track. She set her 400 meter personal best here last year. She was good in the individual. Perhaps getting on terms with Funko Bowl was beyond many people this weekend in the individual event. But Natalia Kasmarek was cool and calm under pressure for the Polish squad. They are Olympic champions and they've shown their class here in winning this A race. Yes. They were half a second slower than the Czech Republic, but there was severe traffic uh, going on. But then you've got to say, you know, you, you've left yourself in that traffic. You've got to have to navigate it. Because the Czech Republic, uh, it was a bit more spread out for them. Yeah, look, I mean, ultimately, it, it was a grand 